In this video, consider one numerical on parallel resonant circuit. Now consider the first example. Find the value of L for which the circuit resonates at a frequency of 1000 radians per second for the circuit shown below. This is parallel resonant circuit. We suppose to find the value of L such that the circuit will resonate at the frequency of 1000 radians per second. So first let me find the admittance of the circuit. The admittance of the circuit is represented by Y. So total admittance will be given by admittance of inductance branch. I will call it as YL and admittance of capacitance branch. I will call it as YC. So total admittance of the circuit is YL plus YC. Now let me find what is YL. So admittance of this branch that is phi u and L that is nothing but YL which is equal to 1 upon phi plus JXL. So rationalizing this I can write it as YL is equal to 1 over phi plus JXL into I will divide and multiply by my phi u minus JXL phi u minus JXL divided by phi minus JXL which is same as this one or I can write it as YL is equal to phi minus JXL divided by phi square plus XL square or YL is equal to phi minus JXL divided by 25 plus XL square. Now similarly I will find the admittance of capacitance branch that is YC. YC is equal to 1 over 10 minus J12. Similarly I can do the rationalizing that is uh, multiplying and dividing by 10 plus J12. 1 over 10 minus J12 into 10 plus J12 divided by 10 plus J12. Therefore, I can write YC is equal to 10 plus J12 divided by. So, it is A minus B, A plus B form A square minus B square that is 10 square plus 12 square. Therefore, YC is equal to 10 plus J12 divided by 100 plus 144 that is 10 plus J12 divided by 244. So therefore, I can write Y is equal to YL plus YC that is Y is equal to YL is phi minus JXL divide we have 25 plus xl square plus yc is 10 plus j12 divided by 244 So now separating real part and imaginary part, I can write y is equal to phi divided by 25 plus xl square that is real part of this plus real part of this is 10 divided by 244 plus j I will take j common I can write 12 divided by 244 minus xl divided by 25 plus xl xl square that is the parallel resonant circuit resonates i can write here the parallel resonant circuit resonates when net
susceptance of the admittance is zero it means that this is the admittance equation this part is known as susceptance part that is imaginary part is known as susceptance part so in parallel resonant circuit when this term is equal to zero then the circuit will resonate therefore with this condition i can write 12 divided by 244 minus xl divided by 25 plus xl square is equal to 0 12 divided by 244 is equal to xl divided by 25 plus xl square cross multiplying i can write 25 into 12 is 300 plus 12 xl square is equal to 244 xl or i can write it as let me continue here or i can write that as 12 xl square minus 244 xl plus 300 is equal to 0 so this is the quadratic equation and the variable is l so solving this quadratic equation will get two roots solving this equation we get so this can be solved directly using calculator directly feed the values in calculator we will get the roots that is first root i will call it as xl1 we will get it as Nineteen point zero one, nineteen point zero one, and another root I will call it as XL two. It will be one point three one. So in the problem, it is given that the circuit will resonate for the resonant frequency of thousand radians per second. That is resonant frequency, which is omega. Omega is thousand radians per second. We know that XL one is equal to omega l1 so xl1 is 19.01 is equal to 1000 into l1 therefore l1 is equal to 19.01 divided by 1000 or i can write l1 is equal to 19.01 milli henry similarly i can write xl2 is equal to omega l2 xl2 is 1.31 is equal to 1000 into l2 or l2 is equal to 1.31 divided by 1000 or l2 is equal to 1.31 milli henry thus we can say that for the value of l is equal to either 19.01 milli henry or 1.31 milli henry this circuit will resonates Thank you for watching.